The rains will soon set in and business owners and residents living close to the new landfill site in the Greater Accra region wants the government to close down the facility. Uh, there have been already several calls to the corridors of power about the serious health risk to them and threats to their businesses. Yeah, brother, take you. When GBC News visited the site, there were several tricycles and trucks struggling to climb the high refuse dump site. The Water and Sanitation Ministry in 2020 announced the closure of the Pung engineered landfill site and its subsequent relocation to an old decommissioned dump site a few meters away from the engineered landfill site. This was because the Pung engineered landfill site was full to capacity and causing a lot of inconvenience to residents and businesses in the area. But the new temporary site still poses a threat as it is also full to capacity. From afar, the site is a mountain of refuse even higher than the recently decommissioned engineered landfill site. Refuse carting trucks and tricycles, popularly known as Abubuya, were busy at work offloading their cargo of refuse. Rainy season expected in April, May, and June this year. Some residents are worried. The dump site at the back is very, as you can see, it's very appalling. The smell alone when it rains is very bad. So I think government should help in um, curbing the situation. Looking at the scent, what have you, the the bad thing. When, sometimes when it rains, you can't even stand it. When it rains and the scent, what it, it's very bad. So uh, what I'm saying is, the government can come in and really move this rubbish down from here to other side. It will do us very good. It's very bad. It's very bad. The scent alone is. I mean, it's giving us a lot of health issues and health problems. When the wind blows very hard, we find we we find it very difficult to even eat. Even when you are just passing by, it's really really serious. The government should do something about it. We can recycle or something. We should just do something about it. If they can move it from here to another location, we'll be glad because this is so serious. Very bad. We can't sleep at night. Close to the landfill site are shops and businesses. Owners who spoke on condition of anonymity complain about the inconvenience the landfill site poses to their businesses, especially the difficulties in dealing with smoke, fire, and the seeping of poisonous liquid into their water bodies from the site.